G'day guys and welcome to Primal Waters. Today we're going to be talking about some uh, articles that have hit the in- internet over the past week and it's talking about the great white sharks in South Africa, how they're slowly disappearing and what is causing this and, and some of the articles that they're referring to uh, the overfishing or the legal fishing of great white sharks and also uh, the link between pods of orcas that have moved into the area. Now we have read and seen in the past that these orcas for some reason have started to uh, prey upon the great whites around South Africa. Now it doesn't just happen in South Africa, there's obviously been cases that have taken place in uh, the United States and here in Australia as well but South Africa seemed to be uh, the main area where this is happening a fair bit and which is making a devastating effect on the population of great whites uh, off the coastline in South Africa. Um, just reading this article here, which I'll get into in, in a sec, um, but my feeling due to this um, events taking place there is that uh, these sharks or great white sharks in South Africa are probably uh, migrating uh, to different countries and one of those countries obviously is Australia. I've read an article where a female great white shark a few years back was tracked um, from South Africa to Western Australia and back to South Africa. So they do travel vast distances and even uh, that video I showed you last night where the island called the Isle of St Paul which is located dead smack in the Atlantic, uh, no, the uh, Indian Ocean between South Africa and Australia, and which has a large population of um, elephant seals, uh, one of the largest species known, and also a population of seals as well. So there's there's an area where these sharks, if they are migrating to Australia, where they can actually go to feed. Uh, But, um, yeah, my thoughts are um, due to... Uh, the pressure on them in South Africa, I think the pro- I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case. Um, you know, Australia's got a massive coastline. Um, it'd be an old, uh, a great spot for them to come, actually. So uh, orcas off the coast of South Africa are uh, preying on grey white sharks and eating their li- livers, according to new government reports. At the very top of the food chain, orcas are ripping out the fatty livers of the unfortunate white shark prey with their teeth. Uh, scientists uh, speculate this behaviour may be behind the disappearance of, of great waters from the waters of False Bay off the coast of Cape Town. Uh, at least seven great white sharks uh, have washed ashore in False Bay since 2007 with the telltale teeth marks indicating they were savaged by orcas. Uh, great whites are big draw are a big draw in Cape Town with visitors are viewing them for tour boats or protective shark cages but their numbers have been in steep decline since at least 2017. Experts have suggested everything from illegal hunting to overfishing to population and even climate change may be behind the drop uh, but the team of government experts report that they may be uh, a connection between the shark's absence and the disappearance of, uh, of a pod of orcas specialised in preying on white sharks. Um, it also goes on and no that's about it actually so probably last week there's actually quite a few of these uh, news stories going around and we've we've all seen the images of uh, these uh, white sharks being found on the uh, the shoreline in uh, South Africa with their livers missing and we've seen videos and stories of it and uh, it seems that um, for some reason the orcas in that area have taken to a liking to uh, great white sharks. Now, what's happening with white sharks in South Africa is not exclusive to there. It's happened in um, the United States and also here in Australia as well. But it seems to be having a fair bit uh, in South Africa. So I'm kind of hoping that these white sharks are uh, migrating to Australia. Um, My feeling that is the case and, and just going over that video last night there's you know, it's it, it just it seems logic that uh, this is the case uh, with the white shark so uh, I'm not too sure if there's any any proof of it or anything like that I'm, I, I assume they would be but um, but 
yeah, it's pretty sad to see what's happening in South Africa. Uh, I really hope that doesn't happen here in Australia. I don't think it will, but um, hopefully these sharks are making their way over to Australia. But uh, time will never t uh, we'll have to tell. Alright guys, uh, that's it for this video for today. Thank you for uh, tuning in. Uh, drop a comment down below, let me know what your thoughts are on this. Do you think that the um, what's happened to white sharks in South Africa has um, put trip pressure on them and maybe they're migrating to new locations uh, around the world, uh, especially Australia, uh, off the west coast, western Australia. Uh, yeah. Alright guys, uh, thank you. Remember to hit that like button, share this video and if you're new to this channel, please subscribe. Make sure you hit the notification bell as well. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next video.